Hello, this is Jaden here with another quick UniView tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how to download and view footage from your UniView system on EasyStation 3.0. To get started, open EasyStation 3.0 on your computer and navigate to the playback settings. In the playback settings, you will see a list of NVRs and cameras added to your system. I'm going to go ahead and select uh, this camera, which is on the front of my office and select uh, the date uh, on this calendar here on the bottom left. So I know that the footage I'm looking for happened on Monday, April 17th. I'm gonna click on search. You will see the camera show up here. Uh, we will go ahead and set that as one camera so we can see it a little bit better. Um, by default, you will see the entire date from midnight until midnight, uh, 24 hours later. You can scroll to zoom in uh, to get more detail on the time. So like now I'm just searching from about 1 p.m. to around uh, 3, uh, 2 p.m. or 3 p.m. in the afternoon. For example, I know that the footage I'm looking for happened at around 2.27 in the afternoon. So I'm gonna select over here 2.27. And because I have motion detection set up on the camera, I can see that this purple line indicates a cross line event. So this is the footage I'm looking for. Now we have the footage, we know what time it is. How do we download this footage? So there are two ways to download the footage. First, we go to download here on the bottom right. You can see that we can download by file or by time. Uh, so to download by file, uh, this works if you have a, a motion event clip. So in this case we do. We can see that the event was from 227.47 to 228.52. I'll go ahead and check that. Uh, we can also see that the length of our recording is 1 minute and 5 seconds, which is perfect. Go ahead and click download on that. The footage will start downloading. You can see here at the bottom left, there is a download in progress counter. Uh, if we click this icon here for the task manager we can see that there is a clip finished downloading completed if we click on open folder that will open the folder that contains the clip so that's going to be my record folder and i have it sorted by uh, date so that we know that the one at the top is the most recent clip i'm going to go ahead and play this with vlc to make sure that it is the right clip and as you can see, this is the clip that we want. So we have from about 2.27, yeah, we have the whole clip here. The second way to download the clip is by time. So this could be, uh, let's say you need to download 30 minutes of footage or one hour of footage. You're not exactly sure when something happened, but you want to have the footage to go back through later. We can select the date and time here. So I'm going to set it to 2.27 to 2.30 and click download. Okay, now we need to select this, click download. All right, now the footage is downloading. We can see the progress here. So the footage is finished downloading now. I'm going to check it with VLC media player as we can see the footage starts at 227 and we can go through and make sure that this is in fact the right footage and we have all the way until 230 that concludes this quick tutorial on how to download the footage from easy station 3.0 if this helped you feel free to give us a thumbs up if you have any questions leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer them uh, as soon as possible. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.